It's very difficult to simulate avalanches because snow is a very complex material and its mechanical behavior is not fully understood yet. Another problem is that snow can behave like a solid or like a fluid depending on the loading. And for example, snow on the ground and snowpack stability are generally treated using solid mechanics, while the flow of an avalanche is usually characterized using fluid dynamics. It's very difficult to find a unified and large strain framework to simulate the whole avalanche process. Our main contribution is the development of a new snow mechanical model which takes into account a lot of important ingredients. So for example, we are able to account for uh, snow compaction uh, and hardening. We also manage to model snow fracture, but most importantly we are able to simulate for the first time the observed collapse of the weak layer, which is a crucial process for the release of a slab avalanche. In addition, we used a new numerical model called MPM. It's a hybrid method uh, which was already used and further extended by UCLA mathematicians to simulate the snow in the Disney movie Frozen. And it allowed us for the first time to simulate both the release and the flow of the avalanche at the slope scale and in three dimensions. We expect our new model to contribute to improve avalanche forecasting and risk management because we can now simulate and thus predict the release size uh, of an avalanche which is currently missing in operational models. Also, we can expect our model to have interesting applications in graphics and in uh, animation. We did not only reproduce the physics well, but we also made a, a really nice rendering of our videos.